Now let's talk about how how you got started, because you know ba based on you know my research, you were living in the Bronx. You know you were involved with the whole you know gang gang thing out there, and you know how how did you go from you know living that type of life to really you know becoming you know the the founder of hip hop pretty much. Well, basically, um, you know, back in the Bronx, we used to get down to the early sounds that was happening around our town from the Motown, Stax, Vote sound to the James Brown, Sly the Family Stone type of sound to that funk, that soul music, you know, what you'll call R&B today. It was, you know, back then it was R&B and soul. And then, you know, coming up together from the gang movement, bringing this sound Coming from the father of hip hop, cool DJ Herc, Africa Van Bada, the Godfather, Last Millennium, the Armin Rob Universal Hip Hop Culture, this millennium, and to my other comrade and brother, the Grandmaster Flash, and then all the other great pioneers like Grand Wizard Dead or Jazzy J, So Sonic Force, the Fearless Four, the Crash Crew, all the people getting together to bring about this old pioneer of funk, this new funk which we call hip-hop culture today, with the five elements of hip-hop, with the B-boys, the B-girls, the DJs, the aerosol writers, some of y'all call them graffiti writers, and then that fifth element that holds it all together, which we call knowledge, knowledge culture overstanding. Planet Rock was a monster hit. It was a monster hit. Like, how did that song come together? Well, Planet Rock comes on a time when there was no type of electro groups happening in the black community. So, by me looking around seeing techno pop groups like Yellow Magic Orchestra, Kraftwerk, Gary Newman, and hearing some of my friends like Dick Hyman, or the guy that made Halloween, John Carpenter, I said I wanted this type of sound for the new sound of a new funk that I wanted to start it, taken from James Brown, Sly and Family Stone, George Clinton, and added it with the flavor of the techno pop sounds of Yellow Magic Orchestra, Kraftwerk, and Gary Newman. Mm -hmm. and thus came the birth of what we call the electro funk sound, yeah. which was Africa Bambada and the Soul Sound of Force, right. with the help of Arthur Baker and John Roby. And then from our sound came your house music, mm -hmm. came your Miami bass, yeah. your freestyle Latin hip hop, yeah. and a lot of the other sounds of techno or electro that was happening after the sound of the Planet Rock. 